Hi, would you like to learn how to take charge of every point you serve by dictating the first ball you receive with your forehand? In today's lesson, I'm going to show you how to use your forehand to be a weapon where you can dictate and take charge of almost every point you play when you're serving. And we're going to begin today's lesson with a drill that I use with my students called the five ball forehand drill that develops your footwork and movement to different areas on the court, particularly to the left to play inside in and inside out forehands. That's going to help you set up your forehand to dictate after you serve. So Randy, we're going to do my five ball forehand drill. And what you're going to do is play forehands off of every ball I feed you. And I'm going to tell you which target I want you to play to, whether it's the green, the yellow, or the red targets. Okay. okay? And you're just going to stay in motion and try to adapt to the ball I give you and play to those targets that I call out. Okay, you ready good. to go? Let's, Let's do, do it. it. Right, keep your feet moving. Ready? Green. Green. Red. Good. Yellow. Good. Yellow. Nice ball. Shot. So you could do that exercise either with a practice partner who's hand feeding it to you or you can do it with the ball being fed to you. The whole idea here is to improve your mobility and get you on the mindset of tracking down forehands, hunting for forehands. So whenever the ball is coming to the left and you feel like you can get around it and dictate with the forehand, it sets you up to really take charge of the point. Yeah. The other great thing is, is that when you complete playing the forehand from this side and you go inside out to the yellow cones, your recovery position is with one or two sliding steps and now you're actually in position where you're dictating and controlling the court with your forehand. So you have right. much, from this position, you have a much greater chance of hitting another forehand. So if the ball went to my left, I could even move out further again and catch it and I can dictate. And we see, we've seen Rafael Nadal do this for years and years, uh, learn how to control and dictate from, with his forehand and from the inside right. out position on the court. So this is a great skill to learn how to do that's gonna set you up for that first ball after you serve. How are you feeling? You're in the mindset of going for hunting for forehands now? Yeah. Okay, so now let's add the serve in. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna serve the ball and I'm gonna feed a ball immediately to you. And I'm also gonna tell you where I want you to play the ball. So I'm gonna get you stimulated, get you active to try and play and dictate with your forehand right off the serve. Yellow. Green. Good job. Yellow. Green. Beautiful. Green. Yellow. I got the wrong way. What do I do it? Green, yellow. Add court, green, yellow. Ready? Great. Yellow. Beautiful. Good job. So when you're setting up to serve, already have this thought process. I'm serving to a certain part of the court. I anticipate a certain type of return. I'm going to hunt for the forehand right away. So that you feel as though you can play with confidence and dictate right from the get-go. Remember, most points in tennis only last less than two touches per player, right? Right. So the most common number of, of hits per point in, in tennis is one maybe two sometimes. So you really, if you get that return back, you want to dictate with that first ball and take charge. Because most of the time, that may be the last ball you play in that right. point. Yeah. Please like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps out the channel. And we have a link in the description down below where you can gain access to our library of free lessons on our website that reveal all the key principles on every stroke that you need to master to develop your skills and achieve your full potential in tennis. So take a look at that. Click on the link down below. Thank you for watching the video and we'll see you in the next lesson.